getting ready for my close up. <laughs> How was your day today? My day was long because I went to work. What'd you do today? I went to work for a really long time. What are you gonna do this evening? I'm going to drink these beers that I stole from work. Yeah! What's your favorite thing to cook? I like to cook whatever makes my husband smile and give me compliments. What scares you the most? Losing anyone that's important to me again. Who's your best friend? My best friend is Charlene Calderon. What's her favorite curse word? <laughs> What's your favorite curse word? Shit. Or sugar hunter icy, like a southern say. What's your worst haircut? I let a friend of me cut my hair and she made me look like Justin Bieber, early days. What's the most expensive thing you splurged on? My car. I don't really buy expensive things. Name one place you want to travel this year. I want to travel to Bora Bora. What's your favorite TV show? <laughs> Dr. Pimple Popper on YouTube and she has her own show now. Name three things you like about your husband. I love my husband's face, his tenacity, and I love his <laughs> other show. <laughs> what advice would you give your younger self? It actually ends up working out. Chill out. <laughs> Who's your girl crush? Gabby Union. Who's your favorite country to visit? Ooh, South Africa. There were lions and tigers, no bears. Oh my. Define yourself in three words. I am bubbly, I am resourceful, and I am indecisive on the third option. Stuck on an island, you can only eat one thing forever. What is it? Chicken. In a regular day, what do you find yourself thinking about the most? My husband. In what settings are you the happiest and most comfortable? I am the happiest around my family and close friends because I can just let loose and be me. If it could be granted three wishes, what would they be? To have residual income from something I love, to be married to my husband for the rest of my life, and to have more wishes. What's something that I do for you that you don't want me to stop? You smack my booty and you flirt with me all the time and I like it. When did you first know you loved me? When we did that date at Lake Lanier, we did the boat and all that stuff, it was great. Based on your experience with marriage, what advice would you give people who are dating? Take it seriously, and if you're not really about the work and the effort it takes to be this happy, then you shouldn't really do it. What's one thing God taught you this week? To let go and let him do it, because he's going to do it anyway. I might as well let it be easy. What's one thing I have never done for you that you wish I would? One of those dates where you like leave little notes everywhere, and I'm like, ooh, where do I go? What do I do? And it's like beautiful and romantic. How'd your husband make you smile this week? <laughs> you know what he did. <laughs> Are there any predictable things about me that you really like? Your bedtime. If we had a theme song, what would it be? Just the two of us. We'll build castles in the sky. Just the two of us. Just the two of us. That's good. You're not thinking about making a career of singing, are you? I just thought about it. You not write my songs with me? Thank you. Get out.